Hey guys, I decided to record a video with the uh, Jack 1 developer mode to visualize these triggers for Gondola in case new runners are having issues with them. I'm going to avoid going into the mechanics of the trick because I don't want to spread misinformation and I'm still pretty bad at it. You can see in the image below, Stellar created a piece of work that shows the triggers. Uh, we'll take a look real quick to see what they look like in game. The first one, that yellow one there, is the death plane. It actually doesn't go out as far as it looks like it does, but it's pretty close. And you need to dodge that, and then curve in and hit the red plane. I'm going to show three examples of this trick. One, dodging none of the triggers so you can see where Jack dies. Um, another one where I'm going to dodge the death plane trigger, but I'm also going to dodge the checkpoint for the volcanic crater below. Um, when you save the game, you'll see it'll say Snowy Mountain. And whenever you go into the miner's tunnel, it would hard lock. And in order to avoid that, you have to hit that checkpoint, and that'll be the third and final uh, video. So right here, I'm going to intentionally miss the checkpoint for the volcanic crater. And you can see that once I save my game, it will say Snowy Mountain. I trimmed the video here for your guys' convenience, and it's definitely not because it takes me between 10 and 15 tries to get Flut Flut up past the barrier. So right here, I'm going to dodge the death plane, but then I am going to make sure I curve back in and get that trigger for the checkpoint. And you'll see when I save the game, it'll say Volcanic Crater, and this is what you want to have it look like. 